Five Differences Between Sociopaths and Psychopaths People often confuse sociopaths with psychopaths, which is not surprising since the two share features of antisocial personality disorder. According to the DSM-5, the main signs of antisocial personality disorder are egocentrism, lack of empathy, manipulativeness, hostility, and impulsivity. Despite these similarities, however, there are some differences between sociopathy and psychopathy. 1. Psychopaths do not have a conscience. This is arguably the main difference between psychopaths and sociopaths. While sociopaths are capable of feeling remorse and guilt, psychopathic traits include lack of empathy and lack of guilt and remorse. 2. Psychopaths are manipulative and calculating. With their charm and charisma, psychopaths can be extremely manipulative and calculating. They are very good at maintaining emotional and physical control so as to organize their criminal behavior. Sociopaths, on the other hand, are less organized and are more likely to spontaneously commit crimes. In this sense, sociopaths are more normal compared to psychopaths. 3. Sociopaths are able to form relationships with others. Because sociopaths are capable of feeling remorse, they are also capable of forming deep emotional attachments, such as with friends and family. Psychopaths are unable to do this because of their lack of empathy. 4. A psychopath's brain is different from other people's. Interestingly, the brain of a psychopath is different from that of other people. The prefrontal cortex, which is responsible for decision-making, social behavior, and personality expression, and the amygdala, which is responsible for emotions, do not light up in the psychopath's brain scan, which means there is little to no activity in these regions. 5. Psychopathy is a more severe form of sociopathy. In sum, psychopathy is a much more severe form of sociopathy. Thus you can say that all psychopaths are sociopaths, but sociopaths are not necessarily psychopaths. So what are your thoughts about these differences? Have you ever met someone with either of these traits before? Let us know in the comments below! If you like this video, make sure to check out our other social media for more content. And don't forget to subscribe! Thanks for watching!